Have you ever pondered the question, how can Stoicism change the way I master my own life? Imagine this, an ancient philosophy born in the bustling markets of Athens that holds the key to mastering your life. This is Stoicism, a philosophy that focuses on understanding the world around us and finding peace within ourselves, despite the chaos that may surround us. Stoicism is not just a philosophical concept, it's a practical guide to life. It teaches us to manage our reactions, to understand what we can and cannot control, and to live in harmony with nature. By adopting a Stoic perspective, we can fundamentally shift the way we perceive our existence, leading to a more fulfilling, meaningful life. The Stoic perspective encourages us to focus on our internal state rather than external circumstances, promoting resilience, tranquility, and ultimately, self-mastery. It's quite intriguing, isn't it? How an ancient philosophy can be a blueprint for self-mastery. Let's delve deeper. Starting at number 10, embrace change. As a cornerstone of Stoic philosophy, the acceptance and embracing of change is vital to self-mastery. Life's dynamic nature means that change is inevitable. By acknowledging this, we can adapt more effectively, allowing ourselves to grow and evolve. This acceptance helps us to maintain equilibrium in life's tumultuous sea, fostering resilience and fortitude. So let's welcome change, as it's through this that we truly understand and appreciate life's rich tapestry. Remember, change is the only constant in life. Accept it, embrace it. Moving on to number nine, cultivate self-discipline. This is the cornerstone of Stoicism, a driving force behind personal growth. It's about more than just resisting temptations. It's about mastering your desires, your actions, your very thoughts. It's about choosing the harder right over the easier wrong consistently. Harnessing self-discipline means you're in control, not your impulses. It's about shaping your character, becoming the master of your own destiny. Remember, without discipline, you're a slave to your moods. Self-discipline, it's the foundation of all virtues. At number eight, practice detachment. This stoic principle encourages us to create a healthy distance between ourselves and our external circumstances. Not to be confused with apathy, detachment is about understanding that we cannot control everything around us. It's about letting go of our attachments to outcomes, to people, to things. By doing so, we can maintain our inner peace, irrespective of the chaos that might be swirling around us. In the face of life's ups and downs, detachment keeps us steady. Coming in at number seven, understand your control. In the realm of Stoicism, control is central. It's about recognizing the difference between the things we can influence and those we simply cannot. Comprehending this difference is a key step towards self-mastery. It's like navigating a ship amidst stormy seas. You can't change the wind, but you can adjust your sails. This understanding liberates us, providing clarity and peace. Remember, control what you can, accept what you can't. At number six, practice gratitude. In the Stoic philosophy, cultivating gratitude is paramount. It's about appreciating the simple joys life offers and acknowledging the beauty in every moment. Gratitude shifts your focus from what's missing in your life to the abundance that's already present. It's a powerful tool that can transform your life from ordinary to extraordinary. It can fill your heart with contentment, enabling you to live a more fulfilling and satisfying life. Gratitude, it's the heart's memory. Coming in at number five, accept responsibility. In the grand theater of life, Stoicism urges us to take charge of our roles. It's about owning our actions, decisions, and ultimately our lives. Accepting responsibility isn't about admitting fault, but recognizing power, the power to change, to grow, to excel. It's about steering your own ship amidst the unpredictable waves of existence. Remember, every action, every decision, every moment is a chance for transformation. Accepting responsibility, it's the first step towards self-mastery. At number four, practice mindfulness. In the realm of Stoicism, mindfulness holds a pivotal role. It's about sharpening your awareness, living fully in the present, not shackled by the past or anxious of the future. Stoics believe that through mindfulness, you can enjoy a more fulfilling life, savoring each moment as it comes. By training your mind to focus on the present, you can better understand and appreciate the world around you. Mindfulness, 
It's the key to unlock the present moment. Coming in at number three, cultivate virtue. In the world of Stoicism, virtue isn't just a nice to have, it's a must have. Virtue in its essence is excellence in being human, a clear indicator of our moral and ethical standing. By nurturing virtues like wisdom, courage, justice and temperance, we elevate ourselves, inching closer to self-mastery every day. This cultivation isn't for accolades or applause, but for the profound satisfaction of becoming our best selves. Remember, virtue is its own reward. At number two, embrace adversity. Seneca once said, difficulties strengthen the mind as labor does the body. In the realm of Stoicism, embracing adversity isn't about reveling in hardship, but recognizing its value. It's an opportunity for growth, a chance to strengthen our character. The next time you face a challenge, don't shy away. Stand firm, meet it head on, and let it shape you into a stronger, more resilient individual. Adversity, it's not an obstacle, but a stepping stone. And finally, at number one, live according to nature. This principle is the cornerstone of Stoic philosophy. Stoics believe that understanding nature's rhythm and aligning our lives with it leads to a content and fulfilling existence. They saw the world as interconnected, and by living in sync with nature, not against it, we can achieve tranquility and peace. It's about accepting the world as it is, not how we wish it to be. Living according to nature, it's the essence of Stoicism. So there you have it. 10 Stoic Tips for Mastering Yourself Seneca's Way We've navigated through an enriching journey exploring the tenets of Stoicism as advocated by Seneca. Let's take a moment to revisit these tips and understand how they can be woven into the fabric of our daily lives, leading us towards the path of self-mastery. Tip 10, Embracing Change, is about acknowledging the perpetual flux of life. It's a call to be like water, fluid and adaptable, ready to take the shape of any vessel life pours us into. Next, we have the cultivation of self-discipline. It's about harnessing the power within to make choices that align with our principles, not our whims. It's a journey to become the master of your own impulses. Then, the practice of detachment. It's not about indifference, but about finding freedom in letting go of attachments that bind us. Understanding your control, tip 7, reminds us to focus our energies on what we can influence and accept what we can't. Tip 6, practicing gratitude, is a simple yet profound shift in perspective. It's about celebrating what we have, rather than mourning what we don't. Accepting responsibility, tip 5, is about owning our actions, our choices and their consequences. It's a call to step up and claim our lives. With tip 4, we enter the realm of mindfulness. It's about being present, fully engaged in the now, not lost in the past or anxious about the future. Cultivating virtue, tip 3, asks us to strive for moral excellence, to be the best humans we can be. Embracing adversity, tip two, is about transforming challenges into opportunities for growth. It's about finding strength in the struggle. And finally, living according to nature, tip one, is about aligning with the natural laws of the universe, understanding our place within it, and living authentically. Inculcating these tips into our daily routines can set us on the path to self-mastery. It's not an overnight transformation, but a lifelong journey of growth and evolution. Remember, the journey of self-mastery is a lifelong one. Embrace stoicism. Master yourself.